The World Junior Championship is coming back to Alberta for the first time since 2012 and Rogers Place and NMAC Centrium will host the event in 2021. To get this uh, tournament back in Edmonton and Red Deer and gold medal game in Edmonton, it's going to be huge for the fans here. But it's going to be a real partnership between the two cities and we'll have the Ice District open. Uh, that's going to be uh, fantastic. Hopefully we can bring a lot of activity to the plaza and to Ford Hall and then fill the building for every game and cheer Canada on. Certainly there'll be two pools, one played in uh, Red Deer, one played in Edmonton to say the least. Um, you'll, you'll see outstanding hockey for sure. Uh, there'll certainly be some dovetailing with the two host committees working together. 2014 we're in Malmo, Sweden and we played in a rink this 4,000 uh, seat facility and it was full of Canadians. You know, and uh, we were in North Dakota in Grand Forks in 2005 and 14,000 plus seat arena and uh, it's full of Canadians, you know, and so and then obviously in Vancouver in 06, so, you know, the, the support and it just tells you what World Juniors means to everybody at Christmas time. Over $70 million in economic uh, uh, investment in the province from the tourism that will be generated and of course, uh, you know, the, uh, the community impact in terms of having young people involved in the legacy projects that will result of this, all of it coming together, it's going to uh, provide a long-term legacy for, for, the, uh, for the game. The NHL is getting younger and younger, so you're watching players that could play in the NHL the next year. But uh, with the junior hockey players are, you know, they're just so excited to put on that Canadian jersey, represent their country. And we look forward to welcoming the world to, uh, to our cities and to our beautiful province, and I hope that everyone does come and enjoy themselves. For more information, visit rogersplace.com.